you can see it, you can fix it. A team of University of Alberta researchers used image sensors and algorithms to help improve an oil sands process. Dr. Shrish Shaw and Dr. Fanindra Jampana pioneered a new approach in collaboration with Suncor Energy Incorporated and Edmonton-based software firm Matricon Incorporated. The project was supported by the National Sciences and Research Council of Canada and i -Corp. Suncor's challenge, measuring the boundary layer or interface between bitumen froth and middlings in their separation cells. In these huge vessels, bitumen is mixed with hot water. The bitumen rises to form a frothy layer, which is removed for processing. Any froth that misses ends up in tailings ponds as waste. With this new technique, cameras monitor the interface, sending a stream of visual data to a computer that uses a complex algorithm to make adjustments in real time. You are now able to reduce, significantly reduce, bitumen losses to the tailings. The impact that this has had is we've been able to reduce bitumen losses to the tailings by over 50%. That's a big environmental win. The new technology has also resulted in $30 million of additional annual revenue. Two more separation tanks now have the similar system. The project's success will not only benefit the oil sands industry, but other disciplines like medicine. For example, the research team is applying the technology to the detection and diagnosis of malaria parasites. Dr. P. V. Jampana and Dr. S. L. Shaw, winners of the 2010 Aztec Award for Innovation in Oil Sands Research, sponsored by Syncrude Canada Limited.